we're going to be de demonstrating the receipt. If you notice, this is the receipt uh, section of the module. We click on receipt. This is an example of our receipt journal. Obviously, according to our economic transaction, we received a, a check from Bel Air Commerce. If you note, the amount owing from Bel Air is $7,000. This is how much we invoiced them originally. And the check that we received in our example is $5,000. The fact that we received this check, we're going to process it. But before we process it, look what's going to happen. The $5,000 will be deposited in our 1060 checking account, and it will reduce the accounts receivable. And I will just demonstrate to you that you can do this all the time, anytime you wish, whenever you're uh, processing a transaction using the module system. You simply click on Display Recipients Journal Entry, and here is the example of what the system will process the moment you enter post. 1060, increase the asset, 5000 goes in our bank account, and reduced accounts received by $5,000. So when we process this amount or this transaction for $5,000, say OK. Look what has happened. If I go to reports, I go to financials, I go to my trial balance, we will now go to the control account, 1200 accounts received is my control account. You notice we have $6,000 remaining. Why? Because originally I had 11000 as a debit and Bel Air paid us the $5,000. This drill entry that we had just po posted will update the control account and at the same time it will update the subledger. And I'll demonstrate the subledger right here. We call this the customer aged. And here we go. It's going to up there. The subledger or the customer age summary account shows that Bel Air now owes us. Uh, then full name is Bel Air Customer Service Customer Bel Air Commerce and Customer owes us two thousand dollars, and the daycare owes us four thousand. When it, we add them together, two thousand plus four gives us a total of six thousand dollars. This is my subledger, and it's aged because the Bel Air was not able to pay us the full amount of seven thousand. And that is the demonstration of a receipt account. Thank you.